Hey, what's up? This is Brandon Turner, and this is my board setup. I have a Skate Mafia skateboard, and it's an 825. I don't really care about colors, but I do like orange. I do like purple. Orange is probably my favorite. I don't mind, uh, you know, air bubbles in my grip either. <laughs> A25, as long as the, the trucks aren't out on, on the sides or too tucked in, you know what I mean? That, that was a problem for a minute because I switched board sizes and then my trucks were tiny. They got to be like flush. I ride uh, independent trucks, 144 hollows, stock bushings. I just loosen them up a little and they're perfect. I ride more on the looser side. Right here I have some 52 millimeter Ghetto Child wheels. I believe these are Windsor's. Windsor yeah, James. Windsor James. Yep. Bearings I have Bronson Speedco. Do you, pop, do you pop the shields off or leave the shields on? No, I leave the shields on. Okay. We ain't got time for all that. <laughs> <laughs> they they go they go. See? <laughs> I have this uh, Wes Kramer Paradox grip mm -hmm. right here. And for me, there has to be a line at the bottom. And the line goes from skinny and then it kind of like goes out. Because my board, my trucks always seem to like lean that way because of kickflips or whatever, right? And I think this reminds me to like do more heel flips and do tricks like that. Okay. So okay. that's what the line is for. I've always done it. I've always set up my boards like this. And if it's perfect, it's like you can't even see it and then it just opens up. I used to do like all the bolts right here and then leave out this one for like the heel, like the heel flip reason oh. too. It's weird. It's strange, huh? It the front truck is the front truck and usually identify it with like the crooked grind mark. But I do them like both ways, but it just, it's the definition is different from a regular cooker grind. How long does a uh, board last you usually? Um, it depends. Some, some go quick because like I break it like really fast because mm. I'm not landing on the bolts or I'll ride it for a long time and it'll be, the, the board will be dust, but there's like that sweet zone to where like all the tricks work for like a day and then the next day it's not the same. When I set up the board and the grip, I don't use a file. And I got this from Chad Muska. He used to just like cut his whole board and then sand it down. So that's what I do. I just cut my board perfectly, as you can see. <laughs> and then I sand it down. Right. So I never use a file. That's what it is. That's it, huh? Yeah. Okay, okay. Skate Mafia. <laughs>